Hi, my name is Zoe. I'm a product manager here at Google on the Flutter team. Flutter is Google's UI toolkit for building multi-platform applications. Today, Flutter is used in more than one million apps, ranging from early-stage startups to large companies like ByteDance, Tencent, BMW, and of course Google, to deliver beautiful, performant, and portable experiences across platforms from a single codebase. Over the past few years, tens of thousands of games have been published using Flutter, from simple puzzles to more complex arcade games. Some of our favorites include Lodum's Four Picks One Word, the popular word guess game, the retro pinball game we built in Flutter for I/O, and PUBG Mobile, who uses Flutter in their social and menu screens where a 3D game engine is not needed. And that's why today I'm here to talk about how we're investing in making game development in Flutter faster and easier. To start, I want to talk a little bit about why Flutter can be a great choice for game developers. First. Flutter is free and open source, giving you fine-grained control over your game's rendering and input handling, allowing you to debug issues at their core and customize the engine to your needs. Second, Flutter supports multi-platform game development, so you can build your game for iOS, Android, web, and desktop, all from one single shared codebase. Spend less time worrying about garbage collection and more time focused on retention. Finally, Flutter games load fast. And are generally very performant, even on low-end devices or in browsers. Bundle sizes can be smaller because the Flutter engine only adds a few megabytes to your game. And while those are compelling reasons to use Flutter for game development, we know that game developers require even more support and resources, which is why I'm excited to introduce you to the Flutter Casual Games Toolkit, a collection of tools, templates, and resources to make game developers more productive with Flutter. So, what's in the Flutter Casual Games Toolkit? First, you'll find genre-specific templates like a card game that provides basic game UI, audio integration, and more complex games with a game loop, showcasing collision detection, animation, and camera using popular open-source game engines built on top of Flutter, like Fling. These templates make it easy to get started building a casual game in a specific genre, such as puzzles, runners, or platformer games. After you've gotten started, it's simple to implement add-ons for things like leaderboards, achievements, authentication, and monetization features such as in-app purchases and ads when you need them. And the best part is, the templates and resources in the Casual Games Toolkit are provided free and open source, so you can easily modify and tweak to suit your needs. I can't cover everything in the toolkit in such a short video, but we've got everything I mentioned and more at flutter.dev/games. Head there to learn more and join the Flutter game developer community.